In this video, I'm sharing my lemon poppy seed cake recipe, so stay tuned. For this lemon poppy seed cake, you're going to need three cups of sifted and then measured all-purpose flour, one tablespoon of baking powder, one half teaspoon of salt, one half pound of butter, two cups of granulated sugar, five whole eggs, one cup milk, one teaspoon of vanilla, one quarter cup of lemon juice, fresh squeezed if, if possible, one teaspoon of lemon zest, and one quarter cup of poppy seeds. Start by pouring the milk and the poppy seeds into a small saucepan. Heat to just before the boiling point. This is called scalding. What this does is it brings out the flavor of the poppy seeds. Put that aside for at least 15 minutes to cool. While the milk and the seeds are cooling, put your softened butter and sugar and your lemon zest into your mixing bowl and beat that until it lightens up a little bit. Add your five eggs, one at a time, and mix after each addition. Be on the lookout for any eggshell pieces. Scrape the bowl down a couple of times during this mixing process. Mix the dry ingredients and give it a stir. Now add the flour mixture and the milk and seeds alternately to the egg, butter, and sugar mixture, mixing after each addition and scraping the bowl down in between. Now add the vanilla and lemon juice. Once it's all in the bowl, beat for one to two minutes. Fill your pans. I'm using six inch pans here, and I'm filling them about halfway. For these three inch deep pans, they get filled about a third of the way. It's about at one and a half cups per pan. Bake the cakes in a 325 to 350 oven. I use 325 and I have a convection until they bounce back or a toothpick comes out clean when it's inserted in the center. Here's what they look like. I prefer mine pale. Once the cakes are cooled, remove them and wrap them and refrigerate or put them in the freezer if you'd like. To make a delicious syrup for your cakes, squeeze the juice of two lemons into a bowl. Strain the juice to get any of the tiny seeds and the pulp out and then add one quarter to one half cups of sugar. Blend that together. Now split your cake layers if you want a four layer cake. This cake is good even if it's a two layer with a lemon curd in between, but I decided to do a four layer for this one. Brush the lemon mixture over each layer, filling each with luscious lemon curd. And I'll leave the link to that recipe below in the description box and at the end of the video for you. If this was a wedding cake, I would make sure to place a dam of buttercream around each layer, or I would mix the lemon curd with buttercream and use that as my filling. The lemon curd tends to be a little slippery, so just be careful if you're doing a larger cake or tiered cake. Now frost and decorate your luscious lemon poppy seed cake. I will share with you how I made this buttercream textured painting on the sides in another video. Look at these beautiful, rich layers of the lemon poppy seed cake and lemon curd. It's incredibly moist. The lemon flavor really comes through and there's a slight crunch from the poppy seeds. This cake gets a huge thumbs up. I love this cake and I think you'll love it too. So give it a try and let me know how it goes. 
Stay tuned because I have a lot more great videos coming. Make sure to click the subscribe button if you haven't already done so, and also the notification bell. Check out the free gift link below and links to other relevant tutorials in the description box. Have a great day and thanks so much for watching and I'll see you next week.